everyone would have a spot, a potential pullback in our crypto's price. Let's dive into the world of Avalanche and learn how to read the signs. Uh, AVAX recently saw a sharp drop of 12.9% within 24 hours, pulling back from 65.39 to 56.89. But what does this mean for its long-term bias? And interestingly, the Avalanche Foundation made headlines with its investment in five meme coins. As a result, these tokens saw significant trading volume and surged higher. But how did this affect AVAX's momentum? Uh, on March 12th, the RSI and the one-day time frame of AVAX uh, formed lower highs while the price pushed higher, uh, indicating a bearish divergence. Uh, what does this mean for AVAX's emission areas future? Just start. The OBV, on the other hand, continued to trend higher alongside the price, suggesting that buying pressure has not slowed down. The former bearish order block at $48, now a uh, demand zone, is a likely target uh, for any pullbacks. Um, but how can we predict where the pullbacks will occur? Um, by analyzing liquidation heat map data from high block, we can identify specific regions um, where ABAX is likely to be attracted to. Um, and uh, the $65.8 to $66 region is the bullish target, but $48.15 and 45.94 are more likely targets given their proximity to demand zones. Um, if Bitcoin prices trend lower in March, it's expected to drag the crypto market further south. But for AVAX investors, this could be an opportunity to add to their holdings at a lower price. And with that said, thanks for watching, and until next time.